Hi viewers, today we will solve example 7.9 from boiler state. This is a series parallel circuit related problem. Here we have to identify the current I5 which is flowing through this 12 kilo ohm resistance, current IS which is flowing through this 72 volt source and voltage V7 which is across 9 kilo ohm resistance. From this circuit we see that this 4 kilo ohm, this 8 kilo ohm and 12 kilo ohm resistances are in series. So, if we take equivalent of these three resistances, this will be added directly. So, this part can be replaced by equivalent resistance of 24 kilo ohm. This is 24 kilo ohm. Now, this 24 kilo ohm and this 24 kilo ohm are in parallel. Two equal 24 kilo ohm resistance of can be replaced by resistance of 12 kilo ohm. 4, 24. 12 kilo ohm. So, equivalent of this part is 12 kilo ohm. Now, from the circuit, you see that 12 kilo ohm and this 12 kilo ohm are series. So, if we take equivalent of this whole part, then this will be 24 kilo ohm. From this side, we see that 3 kilo ohm and 6 kilo ohm are in series. So, this can be replaced by resistance of 9 kilo ohm. Now, this 9 kilo ohm and this 9 kilo ohm are in parallel. So, 2 equal 9 kilo ohm resistance can be replaced by resistance of 4.5 kilo ohm. So, equivalent of this resistance is 4.5 kilo ohm. Now, this 4.5 kilo ohm and this 12 kilo ohm are in series. So, if we take equivalent of this whole part, then this will be 16.5 kilo ohm. Now, we see that 72 volt is applied across this 24 kilo ohm and this 16.5 kilo ohm. If we let this is I1 current which is also equal to I5 and this can be found by using Ohm's law. So, I1 is equal I5 is equal V72 volt which is voltage divided by the resistance equivalent resistance 24 kilo ohm 24 kilo ohm this is 3 milli ampere from this side we see that if we let this is i2 i2 will be equal to voltage 72 divided by this resistance 16.5 kilo ohm this is 4.3636 milli ampere now IS is the combination of I1 and I2 that is I5 and I2. So, IS is equal I5 plus I2. So, this is 7.3636 milliampere. Now, we have to identify the voltage V7. We see that I2 current is flowing through this path and this is 4.3636 milliampere. At this point, this 4.3636 milliampere will be divided in these two paths. This is path 1, this is path 2. In both paths, the resistances are equal. This is 9 kilo ohm and this is 9 kilo ohm. So, current will be divided equally. That is, current if we let this is I3, then I3 current will be just half below of this total current 4.3636 by 2 that is 2.18 milliampere. This I3 current can also be found by using current divider rule, which also will be equal to 2.18 milliampere. Now, the voltage V7 is 9 kilo ohm resistance multiplied by this current 2.18 milliampere. So, this is 19.62 volt. So, I5 is equal 3 milliampere, IS is equal 7.36 milliampere, and V7 is equal 19.62 volt. These are the answer. Thanks for watching.